Hello everybody and welcome back to Mr. P channel. Thank you very much for joining me again. Um, in this video we'll talk Fortnite on Dex. As you see in front of you there is a, a, a thumbnail of the video of the Fortnite on Dex where I was trying to play Fortnite on Dex with the keyboard and mouse support and as you see from uh, likes and dislikes I got 39 up and 113 down. Uh, this is not a popular video on my channel because well majority of of you went to this video just expecting it's gonna work <clears throat> excuse me expecting it's gonna work with the keyboard and mouse and etc so there was no mouse there was no keyboard support there was no control support until now recently fortnite announced that they allowing controller support for fortnite on mobile so i have my old i just hit the mic i have my old Xbox 360 USB controller connected. I'm using USB 360 controller just to prove the point that even this ancient and cheap you can buy secondhand. Like I got this for five pounds here in UK. So you can use something like this to play Fortnite on your deck station. So let's go and see how it performs. So let's minimize. I have Fortnite icon already on a, on a main screen. So let's double click and see how it goes. Fortnite runs straight away in the window mode so it is a bit pain in the backside for you to start the game i mean it's you you're trying to run the game it opens goes through this uh, all the checkings etc by the way before this video even i started recording this video i had to wait for about 45 minutes for a new update to be downloaded and installed and etc etc et so um we're gonna wait for this to load and then I will try to force it to go in a full screen mode. We're gonna see if it's gonna happen. If it's not gonna happen, we're gonna then just carry on with the window mode. And but basically main topic of this video to show the controller support on a Fortnite. So hopefully the previous video which gathered 113 dislikes will be forgiven and uh, you will um, uh, click more likes on this one than on a previous one. So here we go, uh, it's starting. Um, while it's loading, just to give it like a, a, a info, uh, this is Note 9 deck station inside the deck station 3rd gen pad. And that's how I'm playing. And straight away, next item, next item, next item, uh, collect all. Okay, I can see that the controller working because I can switch between the players and whatnot. So, should we try to go full screen mode? Apologies if it's gonna crash, it's gonna take too long, but let's try. I just press Windows up key to force this app to go full screen mode. And the screen went blank and black, and I see nothing. I can't hear anything either. My app crashed. Uh, I can see the phone screen in front of me. The, the Note 9 has a dual screen, so I can see deck station, I can see a phone, and it says Fortnite not responding. Close the app. Right, so tech, from my experience, when you're running an app in a window mode and you're forcing to go to full screen mode, and by you forcing to go to a full screen mode, app crashes, there is a big chance the next time you're opening the app, it's going to go straight into full screen mode. Yes, so let's see how this is going to perform. So at least uh, you saw the, the controller working. So right now we just need to see how it actually performs inside the game. So Fortnite going on a full screen mode. I have my Xbox 360 USB controller connected to the back of the deck station. Uh, and again, I'm showing this. I'm not, I'm not showing you Xbox One or Moga Power Pro controller, how it's working. Because pretty much the control support is there or game sir g5 controller i'm using the cheap one just to prove the point that yes even with the the budget the cheapest second hand usb controller from xbox uh, will work and i was i'm using xbox because pretty much x input is became a little world st standard um obviously i noticed some of you start making comments will ps4 controller work with this will ps4 controller work with that etc etc so i'm planning to get myself a ps4 controller even if i don't have a playstation i'm gonna go and buy a playstation 4 controller just to start trying and testing 
how it goes on my deck station. So, okay, uh, I want to go solo, yes. Uh, quality, not that great. So if, uh, I'm just quickly going to settings, uh, 30 FPS or 20 FPS. So you get a bit of drawback here. Uh, and here we go. This is a controller settings. If you want to tinker with the keys, which keys does what, uh, you can go there. So what I'll do solo and I'm going to jump straight in the match and see how it performs. Obviously, as you see, my level is two. I mean, I, I gained the level two on a Fortnite just by testing it and just killing maybe once or twice <laughs> in the match and that's it. Um, so I'm not a fan of Fortnite, but I know pretty much quite a lot of you are. So this video is for you to show that even if you have like a phone that supports Fortnite and you can run on Fortnite on it, you can grab like something like this, Moga Power Hour Pro Controller with a phone holder. So you stick your phone inside, connect via Bluetooth, and you can go and start gaming Fortnite on the go. So let's go. Uh, jumpy, jumpy. So as you see, and obviously I can move around and twist the camera. It's not somebody con connecting or controlling anything. It's basically me. So right now we just need to jump in the bus and see how we performing bus will start in eight minutes or oh, sorry five seconds eight seconds five seconds and it's about to go it's about to go down so someone's thanking the driver thank you very much i'm just gonna jump and hopefully not gonna die how why i got sorry like i said i'm not i'm not a fan of, I, i'm probably gonna die in, excuse me i'm gonna die in the next 15 seconds or so uh, so my apologies I have no clue what I'm doing come on come on come on come on I want to land somewhere here there's a guy on the roof and I'm gonna die I have no gun and I landed next to uh, some dude and I'll be killed what a good day oh crap no 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 don't kill me I'm recording a video don't kill me let's go let's go other way oh blimey I need a gun. I probably chose the wrong place to. Uh, okay, okay, fine. Let's keep going. Let's try to find some weapons. Quality. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shoot! How to change a weapon? <laughs> probably you're laughing now because marshmallow just killed me. And I'm in 75th place. Wicked, wicked. Let's return back to lobby. And let's see how it goes. Or should I? No, anyway, that, that, that's plenty. That's plenty for you to show that, yes, the controller is working. Um, it's a bit of stutter on my deck station running the, the, the Fortnite. But controller controller is working controller is working and like i said as you see there is a, a light lit up here which is if i press i go home let's go back in the game and and, and it's all fine it's it's if you have fortnite on your phone you can use a controller if you have a phone that supports deck station you can play fortnite on deck station um your mileage may vary i I don't know why, but uh, I noticed some of the different devices because I tried this on my S8 Plus and I tried this on my Galaxy Note 9 and it's a slightly different experience. I mean, it's running pretty much, uh, well, different speed. That's what I, I think. It's, it's a bit weird. It's um, 
it's it's hard to explain, but it, it is running a bit strange. Well, your mileage may vary, but at least you know the controller support is here. So thank you very much for watching. This guy is dancing. That's good. And I'll see you next one. <laughs> so I hope you aren't gonna penalize penalize uh, me and won't gonna dislike this video as much as was just like the previous one. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comment section. <laughs> what the hell are you doing, guy? If you have any suggestions, really, really, you're having a dance, dance off. I'm talking too much. You know what to do. Like, subscribe, leave your suggestions, comment section below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.